food processing is everywhere and how we see it varies. Some think it's unhealthy and even unsafe. What do the experts say? Food processing has been part of our daily life since the beginning of time. It helps us converting raw agricultural material into safe, tasty and nutritious food and beverage. Food processing is a really important tool that allows us to provide nutrition and safe food to everyone on this planet that's affordable and sustainable. Food processing technology helps to manage the availability of the food throughout the year for many people. One key area of food processing is reformulation, where food is altered with the aim of making it healthier. The reformulation expertise that we have takes all the way from understanding our customers' need for reformulation, their recipes, how our ingredients fit into their recipes, with more healthy credentials. As a global player in the food industry, we have a responsibility to increase the nutritional quality of our products. Overconsumption of food in high in fat, salt and sugar may contribute to obesity and non-communicable disease. This is why also we use our knowledge in reformulating products to add more positive nutrients such as whole grains or reducing sugar or reducing salt and saturated fat. Another vital field of food processing is fortification. The practice of using micronutrients to improve the nutritional value of food. A quarter of the world population is still affected by the micronutrient deficiency. The WHO and leading economists have identified the food fortifications as one of the most cost-effective approaches to meeting people's nutritional needs. We consider the nutritional landscape of each country and target population with a focus on emerging countries. And they are designed to cater the local consumer nutritional needs. As with fortification of micronutrients, the addition of dietary fibre can offer health benefits. Populations in most countries do not meet the dietary recommendations of their own governments that are set for daily fibre intake. And accessibility to soluble fibres help them achieve the fibre intakes that are needed. We also need to think about dietary needs of consumers that are suffering from specific health conditions that need specific foods and nutrients. Food processing allows for that and still allows them to enjoy healthy and nutrition food. The use of additives is another hot topic. Additives are regulated ingredients, meaning that they are subject to safety evaluation prior to market authorization in all cases. Our ingredient portfolio helps to increase shelf life, uh, helps to maintain the texture and nutritional properties while the products are getting transported to remote parts of the world where refrigeration might be a problem. 